In this lesson, we're going to identify and differentiate algebraic expressions, equations, and inequalities. Let us start by defining algebraic expression. It is a variable, a number, or a collection of variables and numbers related by at least a fundamental operation or grouping symbol. For example, say we have A. From the definition, it is considered as an algebraic expression because it is a variable. For number 2, say we have 7x. It is also considered as an algebraic expression because it is a number and a variable. This can also be read as the product of 7 and x, which means that there is one fundamental operation in here, and that is multiplication. Because, again, it is read as the product of 7 and x. Another 8a minus 5. So, again, this is an example of an algebraic expression because there is an operation in here. And the operation in here is multiplication and subtraction because this is read as the product of 8 and a. Or number 4. Say we have b plus 6. The operation in here is addition, so it is also considered as an algebraic expression. And for number 5, this is read as the ratio of 9a and 2. 9a has multiplication because it is also read as the product of 9 and a. And when we say ratio, the given operation there is division. So let us define algebraic equation. It is a statement that the two numbers or two expressions are equal. So again, from the given definition, let us have our examples. For number 1, a plus 2 is 6. a plus 2 is an expression. 6 is also an expression. Now, it is considered as an algebraic equation because there is an equal sign, which means that when you find the value of a and you add 2, the answer will be 6. Another, 7x is equal to 35. 7x is an expression. 35 is also an expression. And it is said that these two expressions are equal, which means that when you find the value of x and when you multiply it to 7, the answer will be 35. Another, 2a minus 5 is equal to 30. 2a minus 5 is an expression. 30 is also an expression. And these two expressions are considered as equal, which means that when you find the value of a and when you multiply it to 2, you subtract 5, the answer will be 30. So let us define algebraic inequalities. It is a mathematical sentence that contains the symbol greater than, less than, greater than or equal to, less than or equal to, or not equal. So again, from the definition, let us give examples. For number 1, a is greater than 6. As you observe, the symbol being used is greater than. Therefore, it is considered as inequalities, which means the value of a will not be equal to 6 because the value of a should be greater than 6. And what are those numbers that are greater than 6? We have 7, 8, 9, 10, and so on. So as you observe, the answer in here is not just 1. That's why it is considered as inequality, wherein the value is not just equivalent 
two, one. Another, 3x is less than 21. So, the symbol being used is less than, which means that when you find the value of x and when you multiply it to 3, the answer must be less than 21. And for number 3, say we have 4a minus 5 is less than or equal to 30. Again, the symbol being used is a symbol for inequality, which is less than or equal to. So let us have this as our activity. From the given direction, classify the following as the algebraic expression, algebraic equation, or inequalities by completing the table below. For number 1, negative 3 is greater than or equal to x. What's your answer? The answer is inequalities because the symbol being used is a symbol for inequality. For number 2, x divided by 25x plus 25. So the answer is algebraic expression because there are just fundamental operations which are division, and we have multiplication in here, then addition. So as you observe, there is no equal sign and there is no symbol for inequalities. That's why it is considered as algebraic expression. For number 3, y plus 9 is equal to 2y minus 3. So the answer is algebraic equation simply because there is an equal sign. How about in number 4? x minus 2 is equal to 53. So the answer is algebraic equation 2 because there is an equal sign. How about in number 5? 3a plus 9y. And the answer is algebraic expression because there is no equal sign or symbol for inequalities. And that's it. I hope you learned. Thank you.